Hey guys, welcome back to Death Mark. We uh Shiza, what did we do last time? Was it Haniome? No, it was No the bug teacher. no teacher lady, yeah. Yeah. Pig Not bug lady. <laughs> Miss Zoo. Pig that was, lady. That was her name. Pig lady. Pig face. With them Weird. sexy ostrich legs. And uh the silky snake arms. <laughs> you know what? Let's just go. Anyway, welcome back. Uh, we gotta go to sleep. Welcome back. We're gonna go to sleep. Okay, bye. <laughs> oh, Mary! I don't know why you did that. <laughs> Cause I, I remember we had to still say talk in order to go to sleep. Mary isn't here anymore. I know! Should I rest for today? I guess. Sleep uh, on the couch. Set of rest. Hug Mary's pillow. <laughs> yep. Yep, Miss Zoo. Goodbye. Strange lady. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. Go away. Goodbye. Goodbye. So now it's the bunker. It's been nearly a day since we found Mary. We're like a boat adrift on the ocean without a compass to guide us. I mean, at that point, you would just use the stars, but, you know, whatever. Analogy. Stop with it. <laughs> Who knows where the currents will take us? Follow the stars. <laughs> will we find salvation at the end? If you follow the stars. Just, you know what? Shut up. <laughs> hey, Mr. Questers. Looks like we've wasted a whole day. Is it going to be like this every day? If you're done checking in here, why don't we take a look outside? Mary said unnecessary contact with outsiders could speed up the Mark's curse. And if I lose any more of my memories, I'm not sure I'll be able to function. For the past ten days, the only other person I've spoken to is the convenience store clerk. Oh, for food and such. Has nothing but Cheetos this entire time. <laughs> Great diet. Ah. That explains why we've only had TV dinners and snack food. See? <clears throat> but sitting and waiting isn't going to accomplish anything. I'd rather not wind up forgetting my own name like you. You are- N Not that I completely believe that this cursed thing is real. I hate this lady. Me too. She raised her voice to hide how it shakes. <clears throat> oh. She's still stubbornly sticking to her denial of the existence of spirits in the mark. But I know she's already accepted it. After all, she went through it herself last night. <laughs> what a way to go. Let me those both of them. Mm -hmm. Uh, I was... There you go, that was what I was gonna say. I wish they would say, like, if they're saying it a certain way beforehand, so I at least know how they're saying it. Well, I mean, beforehand. they didn't know people were gonna be reading it out loud. I mean, even before, like, even in books they at least say it like that. I don't know. <clears throat> Ghosts and curses don't exist. Why did this have to happen to me? You're a horrible lady. Jesus. <laughs> you know what? You eat for me. <laughs> <clears throat> he wants a hero. Hero. <laughs> hero is startled at the sudden knock. A visitor in the middle of the night. I don't need Mary to know it's a mark bear. Watch, it's not a Mark Bear. Sorry to impose on you so late, I don't know if to... Ugh. A tall, thin man walks in. Look at those fingers! Look at those cheek... He's like... What? Are you dead? <laughs> How long his neck is. His skin is as white as a sheet, and dark circles nearly swallow his eyes. Almost like a dead person stands before us. Zombie. You know, it looks like our long lost brother. No. Itachi? <laughs> Why do you keep doing that? <laughs> Your quest was in Hero, right? I heard about you and the mark from Yasuo Yasuoka before I came here. Yasuka! <laughs> Something about a missed zoo, too? Sounds like you had a rough night. Well, I mean, if you want to get technical, I mean, yeah, sure. He seems to know Yasuoka. Maybe she's following through on her promise and sent him to help us. 
Well, let's get introductions done. I'm Shu Shuji Diamond. Yeah, Diamond. 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 I think you can guess my occupation. You're a vet. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. No, you're not. Wearing this thing means I don't have to explain, thank goodness. So he is a vet! <laughs> Shut up! He gestures to the stethoscope around his neck. What kind of business brings a doctor like you here? We don't have any animals. <laughs> Diamond's eyes flicker over the suspicion in Hero's tone. No need to be so defensive. I'm defensive. You have to comment in every sentence that goes through. I have the cursed scar, same as you, the Mark. Damn it, Mark. <laughs> he unbuttons his shirt to reveal. My god. <laughs> Do you want to read everything? I'm not reading it, you're reading yeah, it. Yeah, and you're interrupting me so I'm not much. interrupting. All I familiar mark whistle. on the left side of his chest. <laughs> it just... Uh. You, you okay there, buddy? You okay? He's got like a pimp purple it shirt. It just on suddenly me. appeared one day. You're interrupting me now. No, I'm not. Though to be honest, I never thought it happened to me. Maybe it's punishment for being stupidly curious about it. Curious? Curiosa and curiosa. Did you know about the mark before Yasuoka told you about it? Yeah, that's right. There's mention of a strange scar in my grandpa's records as a military physician. Oh. And now we're going to the bunker. I did some personal research. Military physicians' records would mean they'd be from the Second World War. More than 50 years ago. But that doesn't add up. Oh, wrong button. Rumors of the mark only started about a month ago now. If it was mentioned in those records, the rumors would be much older. There's a reason for that. Patients with the symptoms were kept in a secret army lab laboratory. Laboratory. After the war, all top secret documents related to the lab were burned. Except the clinical records I found. A secret lab, huh? I know where it is. That's kind of hard to believe. Dr. Diamond. Diamond. You don't mean to say. How can you? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Scaring cats and laughing at their distress. <laughs> Hello. She rusted my face. <laughs> She's like, I'm scared. The mark was used as some sort of biological weapon. Every country had at least one or two soldiers who were divinely possessed. People only call on gods when they're in trouble. It was the end of the war. Also, how can our guy think they can't believe a secret lab? There's a bunker under the city. In the sewers. Oh. And they were backed in the corner. <laughs> it was too hard. H how unscientific. Don't you think so, Mr. Clusters? I'm gonna slap you. Can't deny it's possible. What? Are you serious? You believe this crack nut job? I can see why Yasuoka gave you her stamp of approval. The way you consider every possibility is indeed admirable. <clears throat> I wish he did. That open-mindedness must allow you to face the supernatural. No, he just doesn't remember anything. <laughs> so I mean, like... I'm pretty open-minded myself. However... Curiosity kills the cat. It's hard to picture the mark being used as a weapon. It seems the 13th Army Engineering Lab was developing something. It was called the Cannon Soldier. It's now Cannon. <laughs> cannon Soldier. That makes me think of the. I'm sorry, what? The body Sattva? A Sattva? Can that bod he sattva? Whichever. Dad bod cannon. 
50 years ago in the Buddha statues. That's like, was that the first time we've seen that word? Yeah. It can't be. It can be. Dr. Diamond, where is that lab? Just call him Diamond. 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 Unfortunately. Diagonally. <laughs> I have no idea. Sorry. The documents my grandpa kept don't give any details about it. I see. I know Google. Google. Oh. Hey, Mr. Clusters. That 13th Army Engineering Lab? It's the shelter Zukawa went to. She pulls out her old map. I wanted to keep it secret. <clears throat> but, as, but as I'd rather not die from this mark, I'll tell you. This shows the entrance to the 13th Army Engineering Lab. Whoa, are you serious? Dude, take care of your sweat. Cough, cough. Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> In his excitement, he starts coughing. M my apologies. Where'd you get that he hero? Up your butt! My grandfather passed six months ago. We were sorting his belongings. Isn't the idea of a secret lab just fascinating? You didn't think it was I know, good. right? So I thought I'd look into it. Oh. And then Miss Zu, Zukawa, stole it. I accidentally let it slip to her. She loves strange experiments like that, so I probably stuck with her. I thought as much, though. Whatever turned her into a monster is down in that secret lab. That's a pretty unscientific line of reasoning. Um, I'm sorry. Are you wearing a lab coat? You don't get an opinion. Using the occult to turn yourself into a monster is utter nonsense. But, if there's a scientific method behind it, I'll have to consider it. I suppose that's just how she is. Was your grandfather involved with a lab in some way, Hero? <clears throat> hmm, he could have been. All I know is, he was an engineer with the rank of captain. Wait, hold on. <clears throat> You're both grandchildren of people involved with the engineering lab? And now both of you have the mark? Yes, that would be correct. Isn't it fascinating? That and our lab coats are probably all Hero and I have in common. From what we understand, people with the mark appeared in the secret lab 50 years ago. There might be something there that will help us find the truth behind the curse. That's also the origin of the cannon soldier. It's just a walking cannon. <laughs> the name that reminds me of a statue. The traces of Miss Zhu in the shelter. It might all be connected to the Buddha statues that were stolen from a hell shrine. Is it, okay. co is it coffee? No. Dr. Daimon gave us a lot of info. We'll have to thank Yasuoka for introducing him to us. The fates are indeed mysterious. Ooh. Dr. Daimon, will you help us? No. Yes, of course. <laughs> She's, he's nicer than her. <laughs> Just don't expect anything physical. Wasn't. I mean, are you sick? You don't look so well. I've been on this diet for the last yes, 10 years. Yes, something like that. Still going strong. Almost at that 90 pound weight. I don't practice what I preach. Ha uh ha. -huh. <laughs> His dry laugh sounds like he's deflecting. A lot of doctors are like that though. He's abnormally thin for a man his age. It's possible that he's gravely ill. Like, um, when I was in the army, I had to go see a nutritionist. Well, I went to see a nutritionist. I didn't have to go. I went to see a nutritionist. Mm -hmm. And, my god, that lady. I'm gonna give you details on how to be, become very nutritious, but I'm gonna be filled with lard. So, we're heading to the shelter? About that. We were stopped from going further by a locked door. And that strange old man was there too. I doubt he'll cooperate with us though. 
it'll be difficult to break in from there. Hmm. Well, it did say entrances. Where did you enter the shelter? A main hole on K Miyamak Miyamachi North Road. Hmm. A manhole, huh? That must have been interesting. I see. <laughs> she opens the map and studies it. You're right, an entrance is there. But there seems to be one other one. It's at... It's at M... No. <laughs> Mano. South Alley. Mano. MNSA. <laughs> Have you tried going there? Mano. No, not yet. <laughs> Mano, not yet. <laughs> You're gonna do that forever. <laughs> then let's go there. Hopefully we can get in. New info was that his favorite fault. Rumors of the cannon soldier. Just one soldier or soldiers? Soldier. Hmm. Quickly, Save. Suavemente, besame. Actually, I don't remember her stats. 7, 14, 9, 10. He just coughed. Are you okay, dude? Wow. His dexterity is through the roof. Yeah, but that power. My god. I mean, it could be also just because he's ill. Whatever, we're gonna to go back to Hero. She's our hero. Yeah, you. I hear. Uh, this thing. <clears throat> yes, Loka sent a new Mark Bear, Daimon to the mansion. He talks about a mysterious being called the Cannon Soldier. He learned from about from clinical records during World War II. Those documents also mention a scar similar to the mark. Everyone who had it worked everyone who had it worked in oh everyone who had it worked in a specific army research facility. They were developing the cannon soldier there at the end of the war. I don't really know what the cannon soldier is, but if everyone involved in the research got the mark, then I can't help but think they were trying to make a spear into a weapon. But why would Daimon, grandson of a researcher and hero, granddaughter of a lab engineer, suddenly get the mark now? Did the soldier's curse spread to the descendants or something? And then there's that 13th Army engineering lab. Hero agrees to tell us more about it. Her old map is of the of, of that lab wow my english the same underground shelter we broke into earlier the key to zukawa's transformation and the stolen statues is likely there so we'll have to go back again the map shows another entrance on m no south alley let's try looking around there this time no. did we read all of hers yes and hanayome we yes. read everything of these shimmy shimmy shammy uh. Oh, yeah. We haven't even started yet. Alrighty. I'm just gonna... Save yet again. Yes. Easy way they do. True. Blip. Blip, blip, blip. Exit. South Alley. Diagon Alley. I knew you were gonna say it. Diagon Alley. <laughs> <sighs> You reach Mano South Alley. Mano? Like the North Road, it's silent and empty. The map doesn't specify the location of the entrance, That just that it's here. We'll have to search for it. It's in the pole. There's a window, there's a manhole. There's it's a, right there. There's a tarp. Window, manhole. I'm assuming it's the manhole, so let's start left to right. There are traces of the name of the store up by the roof. It looks like it's closed now. Are you sure? Do we have anything in our bag? No, no. you just checked. No, I meant like, because you know how we just randomly got the letter opener? Mm. Well, that's that we started with that. Even though this is a residential area, the street is completely deserted. Well, thanks for letting me search so much stuff. 
There's a manhole. <laughs> Unlike K Miyamachi, this road only has one. I'm sure this is the place. The manhole lid has a place to grip it, just like the one at K Miyamachi. This has to be it. Still, this is strange. Why doesn't the public have any idea about this underground shelter? A bit. Shut up. You'd think the sewer department would, at least. How the hell should I know? Do I look like a brainiac to you? I'm just a... Researcher. Scientist. <clears throat> Whatever. Same diff. It was probably hushed up so those involved didn't get into trouble. They supposedly performed some terrible experiments in there, after all. Does she sound kind of excited? I don't know. I gave her kind of a sort of monotone voice. I bet the terrible experiments fascinate her. When I lift the lid, a musty smell greets me. Ugh, this smell... This smells familiar. Well, close your mouth. Like the other entrance, the hole goes deep. Thankfully, there's a ladder here, too. Alright, time to go down. Jump. Hey, go ahead, Mr. Questers. Hero and I descend into the dark world hidden beneath Hell City. What awaits us down in that darkness? Will we find the truth we're seeking? Or a hell smeared with blood? Yes. To all of it. And that's where we'll end this episode. It's a cliffhanger. <laughs> See you guys next time. Bye.